Happy Friday, guys. We're starting off on the rower. Flip your monitors over to calories. That's gonna be our unit for the day. Let's do a two minute warm up, slowly building up in intensity. When we're rowing for calories, it can help to keep the stroke rate a little bit lower. So let's focus on a strong leg drive, followed by the lean back, followed by a follow through pulling with the arms. After your two minute row, we'll hop off the rower and we'll go through some squat and glute bridge variations. We're gonna start with 30 seconds of slow air squats. So going for about eight to 10 reps with about a two or three second descent. As we're going down, we're trying to maintain tension using our hips to push those knees out so they stay above the knees. And then also keeping the lower back and core engaged at the bottom. We don't wanna let ourselves round or soften at that bottom range of motion. Then we're gonna lay down for some glute bridges. We'll start with traditional, both feet down, pushing the hips up to extension. Let's try to get about 10 reps in 30 seconds. Then we'll go for single leg glute bridges. So we'll have one foot pointed in front, pushing that hip to extension. We'll go 30 seconds per side. And then finish up with some glute bridge walkouts. Keep the heels on the ground. Walk them as far forward as you can without those hips touching the floor, and then walk your hips back. And then we'll finish up with a couple more squat variations. So we'll go with lateral squats to start. Set your feet about twice as wide as the shoulders. Alternating sides. Working a little more into that groin as we get into the depth of these squats. And then finish with another set of regular air squats. You can go slow or at just a traditional regular tempo for this round. After that, knock out the barbell warm up. The link's at the top of the screen. Use your barbell for the mobility. We'll set the barbell on the lower thigh, just above the knees, and we'll do a one minute barbell ankle stretch. So notice Kerr's knees are pushing forward, building up that ankle flexibility. After one minute here, we'll set the barbell down on the floor, we'll lay down on a foam roller, have the uh, shoulders on top of that foam roller, face the other way, turn around, turn around, yeah. So she'll be holding on to that barbell with her hands extended overhead. So to start this stretch, you can keep your hips off the floor. If that feels comfortable, you can lower the hips down to the ground. And then to make it even more challenging, you can narrow up your grip on the barbell or to make it easier, widen your grip on the barbell. We'll hold here for a minute. We'll start Friday's class with a barbell complex. We're gonna go six sets, one set every 90 seconds building in weight. You can take this from the rack or from the floor. The complex is three front squats. So have a loose grip on the bar with the elbows high. Descend through a full depth squat for three reps. After your three reps, we'll go right into three push presses. So we'll lower the elbows a little bit, but still keeping them in front of the bar. We're gonna do a dip and drive from the hips and knees. Once the hips and knees extend, keep them locked out as you press that bar to extension. Friday's workout is a comp train benchmark or a repeat workout called Blitzen. Five rounds for time, 20 or 15 calories rowing, followed by 10 thrusters, 115 for guys, 85 for ladies. We're gonna clean that thruster. You can either power clean or squat clean the first rep. Keep a full grip on the bar, pass through a full depth squat. As you extend, drive hard with the hips and press that bar to extension overhead. On the next rep, as we receive the bar on the shoulder, we're dipping down into that next squat. Pick a weight where you can complete these 10 reps in one or two quick but heavy sets. We're looking to complete this workout under 15 minutes. The home gym variation will be five rounds for time of a 100 meter double dumbbell farmer's carry. Make sure we're not letting the shoulders droop and we're not letting the upper back round and relax. Keep the shoulders engaged, stay tall. So 100 meter farmer's carry, followed by 20 double dumbbell thrusters. We'll have the dumbbells resting on the shoulders, descend through a full depth squat. As you extend, drive the hips hard and press to extension overhead. 
If you're doing uh, the accessory work, we have some machine conditioning. Pick any cardio movement and you're doing three sets, eight minutes of work, four minutes of rest, looking for consistency across those splits.